What's up guys, I AppleTuber here and today I'm going to go ahead and show you guys a very helpful video. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to be able to fix recovery mode. Let's say you upgrade to iOS 11 or let's say you have upgraded to iOS 10 or any firmware and you have an issue where you get a recovery mode and you're stuck on the recovery mode. So, today I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to be able to fix that or other issues such as the black screen, the white screen, the iTunes logo screen. For example, one of them is this one. Let me go ahead and show you guys. So, as you can see, this will pop up on your device. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to be able to fix all of these issues and you don't need a jailbreak as well so let's get started so what you guys want to do before proceeding is actually go ahead and connect your device to your computer so using your lightning cable which is your charging cable go ahead and connect it once you see that it's connected let's go ahead and proceed to our computers all right guys so once you're on your computer you want to go first of all go to the description click on the first thing and you'll be here once you're guys as you can see the name of the software is dr phone toolkit it's an ios system recovery it does a lot more as well so as you can see it says it's fixed various ios system issues like the recovery mode the white apple logo black screen looping on start and etc which i have already mentioned the best thing is it's it's actually compatible with ios 11 as well so when you scroll down it actually tells you a lot more like the iphone ipad sock in recovery mode or the mode loop or the itunes logo which i showed you guys that it can't get out of the DFU mode, which is very important. Some devices do get unstuck on the DFU mode. So this software will be able to fix that as well. Then also allows to fix the black screen or the red or blue screen and a lot more. So it, as well, if your device is restarting endlessly, it will as well fix that, which is pretty good. So as you can see, it tells you a lot that it can do. Recover data, recover backup, fix your device and a lot more. As you can see, the reviews are actually very good. So yeah, guys. First thing first is that you can actually be able to try it first so you can go ahead and try it first before buying it. Yes, it's a paid software because it does a lot more and obviously it's not going to be free. But you can have a trial first, try it, see how you like it. If it's pretty good, if it helps you guys, go ahead and get it. So actually, as you can see, I already have the software here on my device. Let me go ahead and open it for you guys. So as you can see, the name is Dr. Phone Recovery Mode, as I mentioned. So for this video, I'm only going to talk about the data recovery, the system recovery, and the data backup and restore. These others you can go ahead and check out for yourself first off let's go start off with the data recovery so as i already showed you guys my device is already connected to my computer so first thing first let it go ahead and find it right as you can see it's now connecting to my computer so let's wait for it there you guys can see it's connected we have the check mark so here first off is the data recovery so you have the messages and attachment calendar reminders kick attachment contact safari so you can go ahead and click or unclick them based on what you want to go ahead and recover. So you have a recover from iOS device. So you can recover them from your iOS device, start scan, or you can do from a backup file. So let's say you have a backup file, you wanna go recover it, you can go ahead and first of all find this, you need to go ahead and select and scan it. I haven't done it, that's why it doesn't show anything, but you can go ahead and scan your devices. It will find the backups you had on your computer and you can be able to restore that backup onto your device. So let's talk about the system recovery. So the system recovery is very important because many people who upgrade to iOS 11 or other firmwares have tend to have issues where the device usually doesn't tend to work properly and a few examples are this one the apple logo and a lot more one of them is also the black screen so it will allow you to fix it as well which is very good so you want to click on start so right there guys as you can see it's not connecting my device to the computer so once again you just want to be waiting for it to be done shouldn't take more than 10 seconds right there as you can see it's done connected you get a check mark you're 100% sure. So as you can see, it brings up your device. I think my system is on iOS 10.3.3, no jailbreak and all that. So what happens next? You guys wanna click on next, then it will ask you to clarify what your device category is. So example, mine is an iPhone. The device type is an iPhone 7 Plus. You can go ahead and enter the device model, the firmware version you can go ahead and enter, which was iOS 10.3.3. Then you guys wanna click on download. So basically what it does, it does download that firmware. So once you have downloaded it, you wanna click on select here. You select the download it and it will go ahead and repair the device. Easy as that, shouldn't take more than 10 minutes. And lastly, let's talk about the data backup and restore. So this is another very important thing when many devices lose their backup and the best thing is for you guys to go ahead and data backup and restore it. So let's say you lose the data, you have the backup, you just put the backup on your device, once again, you're good to go. So once again, wait for it to connect. There you go, check mark connected, where you can click on select all, unselect all, and just click on scan. All right guys, so that was it with today's video. I hope that I was able to help you fix your iOS devices. In case you still need more help, just make sure to comment it down below. Please make sure to also like the video, share the video with your friends and family. Much more content coming very soon. I, Apple Tuber here, signing off.